This is the Girl on British News, presenting the world to the world. The King and Queen, accompanied by Princess Elizabeth and Princess Margaret, had a great reception when they arrived at Weymouth on their way to the Royal Naval College at Dartmouth. The Royal Party were greeted by Vice Admiral Sir Dudley North, and on the quayside, two Weymouth schoolchildren presented bouquets to the princesses. Then the King and Queen and the princesses put off to the Victorian Albert for the trip to Dartmouth. On landing, the royal visitors were greeted by the Mayor of Dartmouth. 1911 and 1913, the King was a cadet at the college, and except for a brief stay in 1919, he had not been there since. So for a short time, His Majesty lived over again his boyhood days. Parade of cadets mustered about 580 strong. Then the cadets marched past the king. A visit to the gym was included and the royal party watched the men drilling with much interest. Next, a swimming pool, where a thrilling race was going on, to say nothing of several amusing water sports. In commemoration of their visit, the king planted in the college grounds a purple beech tree, the queen a golden beech, Princess Elizabeth a white beam tree, and Princess Margaret a scarlet chestnut. While Princess Marjorie was planting hers, the king said to her, you must do it at the double. Remember, you're with the Navy now. Mm -hmm. 